Welcome back to Valhalla. It's that crusty psycho. But is it really, though? I don't know. We're going to work. <clears throat> oh, okay. Is there... Okay. Uh, we read all of them last episode. Okay, cool. Uh, I had it muted. Cool, now I can hear. Uh, ah. Evening. Oh, hi there. Oh, hello there, beautiful woman. Oh. I was expecting the bar to be different before opening hours, but I guess it's just the same tired thing. Alma? Ah, Leonidas. Gillian. Marcello? I... I stumbled across her on my way in and asked her if she wanted to tag along. Did I call luchadors? Excuse me? The luchadors. Oh. Michael? Yes? You know me. <laughs> You're like I a, a thick, like strapping, luchadors. oiled man. You know what? <laughs> You're not wrong about that. <laughs> uh, hope you don't mind. Sure, make yourself at home. Where's Boss? She didn't put the helmet on again, did she? She went out for a bit. I don't know what for, but she'll be back. Does Alma work here? Or is she a regular? I guess we'll find out. All right. Alma, make yourself comfortable while I prepare. Right, thanks. I really like this this playthrough right here. Play Like, this playlist. Yeah, but it's... we'll never get, never get to hear the other songs. <laughs> That's why I said just do them in order so we get to hear all of them. Uh, yeah, you're probably right. Wait, it's too late now. Uh, where do I go from here? I don't know. There's only 12 pages. No, I was reading the line, the, the song. <laughs> <laughs> you're like, oh boy, this is going to be a long episode. Ugh. If if you can't tell, the stream kind of kind of ringed me dry. <laughs> um, time to mix drinks and change lives. What was that? Oh, just something they made me say back in instruction. Kind of stuck. Huh? I went to a school that made us stand up with our hands on our backs when someone came in. The habit didn't rub off until high school or so. Ah, uh, please don't say high school and rubbing off in the same sentence. <laughs> James brings did a back, lot of that. Brings back bad memories. Yeah, it's kind of like that. <laughs> oh yeah, look at this. A uh, glass with a signature. To J... J... Um, I'll assume it's either an autograph or an impromptu medicine recipe. That Kara Miki girl came here yesterday uh, before a concert, actually. Oh yeah, what did you think about Dorothy? She was She's a quite sad a character. She was sad. <laughs> oh, yeah, now I see her name here. You don't seem very surprised. I like B Link more, actually. The stoic looking duo, right? Yep, those. Yeah, I can't remember what shit is told in the first Dorothy meeting or not. A lot of, like, almost pedophilia kind of stuff. I mean, and then just, we just we got a little built. bit. We got a lot more into um, Ingram, in a oh. sense, because yes. Dorothy was talking about Ingram's like, not specifically Ingram, but someone uh, hiring her to be. It's. I mean, it's pretty daughter. obvious. Right. It was sad. Right. I mean, it's less sad about her and more sad about the dude. Right. Um. If I was there, I'd be like, fuck it. I mean, if I want to get treated like daughter, just lays around all day, like that, that sounds pretty worth. <laughs> right. Um, uh, seems you had a better day than mine yesterday. I had to break up with Damien. I see. Want a drink? You don't seem very surprised. Alma, we've known each other for, what, a few months now? <laughs> I'd be interested if those relationships of yours went further than a week or two. You say you broke up, but there's usually not enough time to foster something to break. It's more like, the guy wasn't what I wanted, so I stopped flirting. 
<laughs> I could pretend to be more interested, you know. Like my mom says, if I don't buy it, it's because I don't. Blah. Yep. Ah, <laughs> blah, 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 blah. Blah, 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 blah. She's like, is your mom okay? <laughs> is she fine? Nope. Moving on. Hmm. Speaking of buying, do you want a frame? A uh, frame? Yeah, for those pics you have of your boss, the ones filling your phone's memory. Some seem sneakily taken at Aww. that. Aww. Is that true? What do you care? Gillian just reminds me of that douche who's just like hiding in the behind the bar. <gasps> yeah. I'm getting all the gossip on Jules. And then Jillian, Jill just punches him because she hates being called Jules. Did I say this line? I don't think so. I feel like I did. Moving on. <laughs> That's what we do here. Do you have the correct color scheme on your lights? Yes, I haven't changed them. Are the rest of them turned off? Yeah. Well, Mike, I gotta say, I'm pretty proud of you. Actually, I changed the blue to purple, like a darker purple. Why? Because I was doing something else for it, and I really like the purple. So you lied to me. I oh, do you want me to change it back to blue? Yeah, the the <sighs> the places where all the drinks are kept is the exact shape. There, it's blue. blue. It was so. Don't it's you blue think now. It, sense it, our... it made no difference to the recording. Our shells would have the same color. Doesn't that just make sense? No, nothing makes sense anymore. All life is a lie. Time just, is a. Isn't, isn't that is, just whack crap? <laughs> you're whack crap. I'm not even high right now. <laughs> not even one bit. <laughs> not even a bit. <laughs> uh, how the hell did you find out? How, blah, 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 sh, Jesus. I got a phony okay. pony. G give me one second here. Are you okay? <sighs> no. How the hell did you find that out? So it is true. Shut up. I'm a hacker, remember? You shouldn't piss off a hacker. Oh, I really like the one of her sleeping in her office. I think I'll copy it. You! Hey, can you make me a bad touch for you keep arguing? Oh, so she's into that, huh? Oh. Sure. Emma wants a, a bad touch. Oh, bad touch, man. Excuse me? Oh god, what was that from? I don't know. What are you talking about? I don't remember, but someone used to say like, Oh, it's it's bad touch man. <clears throat> bad touch man. I mean, that sounds like 15 million different random new grand new grounds animations. So One, you could two, literally three, four, five, be describing anything. Six, and you'd probably seven. be right. I made a super big bad touch. Huh. She didn't ask for a big one. This is one big bad... Are you hitting on me? You yes. wish. Uh, so who's Damien again? The one with the nice car. Cherry is also the manager. Wait, did she ask for a big one? I don't know. Well, why'd you make a big one? <clears throat> I don't know. I felt like it. Were you hitting on her? No. I feel like that was something I would do because uh, she's hacking my phone. Sure, he's also the manager <laughs> at the bank, but that car was caught. What ca I mean, to be fair, she did make friends with a hacker. That's true. So I can't, can't really blame her. And what was wrong with him? Turns out he was a LARPer. LARP? Live action role playing. Sounds more like the nickname of some heavy hand writer or a military organization. What do you role play as? Have you heard of the Woodstock Fairs? Those events where people barely dress, stink, roll in the mud, and fuck in the open? Those are hippies, yeah. He frequents those. It's something I'd rather not deal with at all. If I stayed with him, I'd eventually have to. I'd eventually have to. I mean, I need to support my partner in what he does, but if it's something like that... You see, that's the problem right there. 
You say breaking up like you had something formal, but most of the time you're still getting to know him. Think about it, have you ended your longest lasting relationship for things like those? Okay, sorry for not using the right word over and ever, but I'm still sorely disappointed. And at least I'm trying to get some action. When was the last time you spent the night with someone else? Uh, last night? Your cat doesn't count. Hey, my cat's pretty sexy. A year ago, oh, it was messy. I'd fuck a cat. <clears throat> so now we have it on recording record <laughs> for all our uh, viewers to see. Uh, you've heard it here first, folks. Michael uh, would fuck a cat. Yeah, my he's dick just... would probably get really itchy because I'm allergic. <laughs> he's uh, he'd, he'd be good friends with Shane Dawson. Oh my god! <laughs> see? Was that a thing? Yeah, there was like... It was like some not well-known podcast uh, from like years ago where he said something about uh, like rubbing his dick on his cat and coming and then he was like no it was just a joke like I was just making a this, like an out there joke and I was like I don't know man you kept that you 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 went in depth about that <laughs> oh god so you know what I'm not gonna say one way or the other whether it was whether he was making a joke or not, but it got blown up and it was really funny. <laughs> is is that why he retired? I doubt it. Did he retire? Yeah. When was that? Um, a couple months ago. Oh, well, <laughs> the thing was before that, so I don't know. It was funny though. I mean, I have no idea how you deal with that. And again, I'm not saying this way or that way because I don't have the evidence of whether he was joking or not. But it was just funny to me. <laughs> if I were you, I would have pushed Fuckboy over there into a closet ages ago. Oh, Jesus. I mean. F Fuckboy? Help! I wouldn't. I wouldn't deny you. Gillian I... just runs. Listen this reminds me of Hong Kong! <laughs> uh, Gillian. If there's anything I've said on this show, it's that it's like, I like tan women purple in sweaters, and she's got all three of those going for me, so I would not deny such a notion. <laughs> uh, people have different needs and priorities. Yes, but don't you miss having the warmth of someone else at your side? Using them as a pillow, mixing your perfume with others? Jill's just like, why don't you just fuck me yourself? Putting your head on their chest, listening to them breathe as they pet your head. All right, now you're just calling me out. <laughs> you are Alma and Sense. You're like, I love just being pad pat. Yeah, like big old pair of titties, getting the head pats, feeling the warmth. James, very lonely. Uh, James, James. <laughs> <laughs> Like, that's, not, that's just real shit. Like, I'm very lonely. <laughs> that oh, my oh my god, that reminds me of the time where my ex asked you to open a bottle of water and I grabbed out your hands and you, you whipped the bottle at me and you screamed, I'm so desperate! Yeah, it's just like shit. You're like, you're yelling at me because I did the thing and I was just, I was. Had a minute-long existential crisis. <laughs> I'm sure I've said many things to that de to that degree. Th that was the funniest the one every single time. <laughs> that was so funny because it was no, so... it wasn't. I can't remember what exactly happened, but <laughs> because you know, like hit me or something, and I was just on the ground with my head in my hands. <laughs> no, that's not how it I, happened. I just started freaking out. Something like that. No, I took the bottle from you, and then you ripped it from my arms. He goes, I'm so desperate. So you cracked it open, shut it, and whipped the bottle at me. And, and you're like, can't I just get a woman's touch for once? <laughs> and then you just laid there with next to me in your existential crisis. And I, I think that was the same day you- down on the floor. <laughs> And I think it was the same day you threw a fucking candy corn pumpkin and bruised her. I can't believe you defended her. Uh, I barely I, threw that thing. I had to. You didn't? I would have been hurt. But to be fr yeah. Um. I had to protect myself. I'm sorry. I threw a... The, the story's not long. <clears throat> For anybody who knows those... You know, like candy corn, but it's like the one that's in the shape of a pumpkin. 
Like, I had one of those and I just threw it at his ex. Just, you know, be funny, throw a thing at her. And it hit her. And she started crying. <laughs> like, it wasn't even a hard throw. It was like a little It was, like, it was a hard throw, but for some reason it just hit her in the right way and it somehow bruised her. And she's. I, I then, like, Mike yelled at me and I was like, you gotta be kidding me. I was so pissed <clears throat> off that th this was a thing that was turned on me. <laughs> It was, it's been turned on me. I'm then, sorry. Like, like, how... Then later on, you're like, oh, Michael's was just trying to do self preservation. Right. Uh, anyway, I'm just gonna keep reading. <laughs> all the, all the it's like, can you please keep reading so I don't forget my, so I can forget my ball pain. So I, so I don't start getting angry at Gwen. <laughs> <laughs> oh. What do you mean, oh? You said the name. Yeah, I didn't say the full name. That's true. It doesn't matter. <clears throat> Ugh. <laughs> um, I'm so lonely. I've, I mean... <laughs> I'll say it... <laughs> I'll, I'll say it as much as you want, Michael. It's not gonna get any less real. <laughs> I know. I love how you... Can you hear girl. it in my tone of voice? <laughs> yes. That's why I'm laughing so hard. Oh boy. Dozing off knowing they're there watching you, protecting you. Oh, stop! <laughs> uh. <laughs> oh, sorry, I didn't mean to quit. It's a chill. Anything I can make you do to shut up and drink? Same. Same, Jill. <laughs> I'll have you know that my Uncle Juan taught me to ventriloquism when I was 12. The cat? Excuse me? Juan the cat. From if Monster you did Camp. not watch our monster uh, camp playthrough, that is going to be a very obscure and unknown reference. <laughs> There's a cat who makes us drinks. Right. I should have given him a Spanish accent. <laughs> oh, just keep going, please. Before I blow my brains out. Drinking won't stop me from talking or making tasteless puns for Aunt Rosa. Still, get me something weird, would ya? Huh, ventriloquism. Weird. A weird drink. Yeah, something different. Experimental. <clears throat> uncommon. Well, let's see. A weird drink. Hmm. Promo drinks fit that bill easily. It's so unnecessarily brown. Jill just think? shits in a cup. <clears throat> <laughs> Two girls, one cup. <clears throat> I've oh, never God. actually seen that video, but you know what? It probably wouldn't affect me, because thinking about it now, I've seen worse than than two girls eating shit. You want the Grizzly cup. Temple? Uh, what, what do you, do you think? think's gonna be the weirdest one? Piano Woman's fine. Piano Man is... Sing us a song, Miano Pan. Zen Star is fine, so it's either Bloom Light or Grizzly Temple. What's a Bloom Light? The two girls, one cup. What's a Grizzly Temple? Something unbearable. I'm gonna ask you to actually click on it, Michael. The, this one's go. kinda unbearable. It's mostly for fans of the movie that it was used to be in. Let's give her that one. It's bland, though. Yeah, she didn't say give me something tasty. Did she? Nope, she did not. Three, 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 one. Boom, 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 boom. <clears throat> I have gone into existential mode here. Yeah, that fits the bill. It's a promotional drink made to commemorate a movie. Red, they leapt at the chance to sell drinks that would be unmarketable otherwise. Oh. oh. You know, your orders are weird today. They are. Yeah, usually first thing he asks for is Brantini and then something like a cobalt velvet, something similar. Well, I sometimes feel like I need something different, you know? Something tells me part of the reason he left this Damien is because he was too deep into routine. Maybe. Hey! Speaking of routines. As hacker, what's your opinion? <laughs> Oh, Christmas! She just started. She just starts crying. 
<laughs> I was yawning, but that would be funny as well. No, I, I just start crying. <laughs> <laughs> Big old titties. <laughs> I'm so lonely. <laughs> I'm so I desperate. I just want warmth. I haven't felt the touch of the woman besides my mom, God bless her soul, in like <laughs> three years. It's been longer than that. It's been like five years, <laughs> legitimately. Wait, let me do the math, actually. No, it's five years, I think. No, it's not. Okay. I've been in college for four years. Yes. Six years. Six years. <laughs> I mean, I don't even have anything to say about that. That's a hack. What's your opinion of the whole Alice Rabbit thing? You know what this episode's title is going to be? James is slowly. <laughs> or James is desperate. Ugh. Is, can I have your approval for that? I don't know what happened to me. I was perky during the stream <laughs> and some, something about something about the game mechanics pissed me off and I was like, oh, I need to take a nap because I'm I'm going to be pissed off. And I took a nap and now I'm just tired and when I get tired I get ex I get fucking <laughs> existential. Not, not not really. I oh just, god, this is funny. Self deprecating. I have never seen him this self-deprecating. No, and that's not true. That's not true. But when he gets this moment, he's like all happy and cheery, and then he just goes, I'm so lonely. <laughs> and it makes me laugh so hard. It's called, in, in Japanese culture, they call that the Gap. <laughs> like the clothing brand? It's not Gap Moe. That's wrong. You, you know what, Michael? Yeah, sure. Let's go with that. That's the sounds of somebody who just heard something stupid. <laughs> Stupid enough to warrant the speech they've prepared just for occasions like this. As always, very perceptive of you. You know, decades ago, there was this group of people that hacked simple sites with an agenda. Can't remember what they used to call themselves, I just remember it was pretty petty vandalism. I believe they were called, um, Anonymous? Anyway, everyone that participated started using the same name. So yes. They wanted to create this anonymous, anar so yes, anarchist identity. The whole Alice Rabbit thing is the logical conclusion of that. So what happens when that idea reaches its breaking point goes mainstream. I thought anonymous was mainstream. That's why they stopped doing shit. Yep. It's no longer a group, but an individual. An untouchable entity watching from the shadows, monitoring and judging everything anyone does. They've seen all the porn. Fuck. You naughty boy. Observing, tolerating no one but itself. <clears throat> a lot of bullshit for what's essentially a pet that press the, 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 the press made up. The antithesis of your usual boogeyman, if you must. Make sure you said bogey. Don't put a stopper on my groove, Michael. I'm so lonely. <laughs> <laughs> That's exactly what putting a stopper on my groove is. <laughs> oh, so, God. you don't think such person exists? I don't know. Don't care. I mean, we have seen the actions of such an entity. There's something in your nose. There's something in your nose. <laughs> I don't care. Uh. What was that? Me getting grossed out because snot's all over my nose, my hand now. Oh. <laughs> oh. For me, I'd just look it off. Anyway, but it might oh, be yeah. anything. <laughs> an individual group, an artificial intelligence. And now we have that on on recording that James likes snot as a fetish. I mean, that's so, so ridiculous. You could uh, you could never frame that as me be telling the truth. It, it helps him with his lube. Oh, God. <laughs> you know what? <laughs> Besides, like, I don't know, blood or shit, that might be the worst thing I could think of to use as a loo. What about pee? Pee is... I mean, it depends on how much water you've had. Because if you're just, like, chock full of water, it's like, alright, well, it's just water, and that's not even... That's not even luby, that's just water, and water is just rough. Oh my god, this is whole, This is funny to me, this is so funny. I mean, it's just common sense. You just this think is... about it for a couple okay, seconds. Okay, nothing was like... funnier when I said unbirth, and you just took ten seconds to be like, <laughs> wait, <laughs> what? <laughs> he said something. I don't remember what you said, but you said unbirth. 
and I was just reading the line and it took me like five <laughs> seconds for my brain to process that word coming out of your mouth. I was like, wait, what? <laughs> it wasn't the fact that it was like gross or weird because I've, again, I've been on the internet a long time. I've seen some shit, so it's, it's not going to like, it didn't excuse me. Just the out. fact it that just, it came from my mouth. It came from Michael's mouth. <laughs> and I was like, what? When did you find out about that? <laughs> what did you learn? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Jay, that's so funny. He's learning. Right. <laughs> He's becoming self-aware. We need to take him out. <laughs> anyway, please, please go on. I didn't even think you read this line. What about it? I don't think you read it, but okay. I did read it. Because I specifically <laughs> remember saying artificial intelligence in, instead of AI. That's not taking into account all the copycats and pranksters using the name. Fuck. <laughs> so, Alice Rabbit is a thing that exists, but it's also really muddled overall. <clears throat> oh god. Actually, the pronunci pronunciation was muddied. Yeah. Remember when I said I was kind of like pissed for no reason? Yeah. Not, well, I wasn't pissed, but frustrated. And I, yeah. can, I can't exactly t tell you on what it was. Is it the fact that you can't get Rayman to work? <clears throat> no, 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 no. Something about the stream. Like, I don't know if it was the game mechanics and, like, it not being super obvious what choice will be will work or not. Or something else entirely. But I was like, man, I'm... And it was a long stream. And I also lost. And it feels like I lost because of the mechanics that didn't make sense. So it's I, all guesswork. I, yeah, it's all guesswork, so I was just like, I don't feel great. <laughs> I didn't eat. And so I just, like, took a nap. And now I'm tired. But after this is done, I'm totally making a bowl of macaroni and cheese at, like, You didn't eat dinner? No, but I'm gonna. I've been but waiting... Just... Um... It, it, it was the same thing as, as eating dinner. It was a way to change my mood. But no, I'm totally going to make myself a bowl of macaroni and cheese at 2.30 2 in, in the morning after this episode is done. Great. And I think that's funny. And that's just where my life is right now. <coughs> uh, there's something else that worries me, though. I got a story that catches the attention of kids and such. They start trying to hack stuff without knowing the risks or consequences. Imagine if, suddenly, a group of tweens broke into this bar and started asking for drinks. That's how it feels for me, it's thanks to that damn Dallas Rabbit thing. I see. Enough of that, there's a more pressing matter at hand. And she's like, what's that? And she's like, my hand against your throat. And she just violently grabs her and starts choking her out. She's like, <laughs> And Gillian's like, yeah, I'll let this happen. And then you just die and it's game over. Well, what would you think about that, Michael? I think I'd be sad. I'd be a little sad. It'd be abrupt and a strange way for the game to end. <laughs> right. Yeah. But you know what? I guess it's when, what's your game, your art direction? <laughs> uh, there is? Yeah, you've been delaying my invitations for hanging out some time for too long. Oh, that. Do you hate me that much, Jill? Does my presence make you that uncomfortable? Yes, you're extremely hot and you're... I, you, I'm in I'm love with my boss. I'm very uncomfortable because of that. No, I... Uh, this right, it might just crash by your apartment. That way you can't just say no. <laughs> she walks in and she's built like a shrine dedicated to her and she's just furiously masturbating. <laughs> she opens the door. <laughs> Jill just turns around and goes, I'm so desperate! No, no. <laughs> she opens the door and it's like, um... It's like she's caught a meerkat. She just violently looks at her like... <gasps> Just like, oh! <laughs> this isn't what it looks like. <laughs> That's so lonely. <laughs> um, maybe I'll also crash for the for the night. <laughs> huh? Oh, excuse me. Maybe we could have a sleepover, braid our hair, tell stories at night, shower together. Sorry, what was that? <laughs> uh, braid our hair. You know you need some human worth in that place. Your tits alone for <laughs> my entire bathroom. Man, you react too nonchalantly. It's no fun. React a little bit. Let me tease you for a second. 
I just imagine <laughs> Keisha Bay Rohan. I refuse. I refuse. <laughs> Such a good meme. Oh my I use God. that meme too often. <coughs> In all seriousness, though, any particular reason you keep turning down my invitations? I mean, it's not a date. I just want to have a conversation with you outside of these four walls. Listen, woman, I'm furiously homosexual, and you're you're too hot to, to make me like comfortable around you. I'm not a morning person. Ugh. I registered for a night shift precisely to avoid waking up early. Jill is just hitting too many of my relatability factors. <laughs> this is a game where you're like, I am absolutely Jill. <laughs> yeah. Earliest I've asked you out is 10 a.m., you know? I mean, you've seen her in her apartment. She just wears the same thing. Right. She's got black brunette hair. She likes to fucking just take it chill. And she hears bullshit and is just like, what? <laughs> Excuse Wait, sorry, can I repeat that? <laughs> Wait, what? Yeah. Wait, what now? Uh, that's early morning by my standards. <laughs> oh. Oh, this is the fucking jam. I'm bopping in my seat tiredly. Can you tell from the tone of my voice that I'm bopping in my seat? No, I'm just waiting for you to read your line. I'm no longer bopping in my seat. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's not that I don't want to hang out. It's, oh, Jesus. <laughs> what the fuck was that? That, was, that, was, that wasn't quite a voice crack. It was just like my throat. I don't out. know. I just I don't want to hang out. Hoity, with hoity, hoity. <laughs> I just want to wake up early. And she's like, well, you don't gotta wake up. Me. Right? You are hopeless. Anyway, I'm gonna need another drink here. <clears throat> like, say, Big Brantini. Finally, that's the alma I know. Big Brantisi? Big, Big Brantisi? Are you okay? <laughs> no. Suck me off. Right here, right now, Michael. Drop your trousers! Do it! My Send your dick through electronic portal so it goes to my screen. No. I don't I don't I'm not hearing your trousers being dropped. <laughs> they're they're not like, even oh, on. <laughs> <laughs> I'm kidding. I gotta stand up and prove it. I can't see it, but the audience will what? be able to tell. Uh you only used one Adelhide and you need six. <laughs> Do I use six? No, I, I only use eleven. Oh no 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 no! You're right. I'm sorry. I forgot that it does the thing and then it does the other thing when you fill it up. There you go. <clears throat> and we're also making a big one, so I six the ages. wouldn't have six would not have worked anyway. There you go. Here, bitch. <laughs> well, I was gonna. Do, I, you know what? Never mind. <laughs> you know, Frantini is such a weird name. It was originally supposed to replicate the Martini. Problem is, the BTC got a hold of a brand of vermouth that was named after a certain automobile company. So, on a weird whim, they changed the name. I see. There is a California Brantini. Uh, you know, I was wondering, you've seen that video, right? Yes. It's so fucking good. Yeah? Don't you worry about what the people you work for might be doing with the information you provide? No. You don't. Do you worry about what happens when people leave this place drunk? Not really, most of the time. Well, neither do I. Why should you? Do you get people drunk? Oh, not most, not these days. Some say my beauty is intoxicating, but that's besides the point. I get my payment, do my job, and forget about the whole thing. You make your job sound so easy. Once you understand what precautions to take, it's no problem. I've always found my job fun. However, most of my contracts are consultancy-based <coughs> gigs. It's not like every day's a thrill. 
What a thrill. Do you meet with your client or? Yes, big boss. I don't. It's always <laughs> from behind uh, as many filters oh as I can manage. Hey, James, I have a question for you as we're continuing this. You know, I know, we got, I, I know we got another long stream of Sonic coming up soon. Do we? Yeah, Sonic Adventure 2, remember? I don't, but I do now. It's our extremely long streams. And I am <clears throat> dying in the inside more than I ever have been. It's only Sonic Adventure 2. That shouldn't only be like two long streams. Yeah, sure. Do you want to play Doom after that? Which one? The the one before Eternal, 2016 Doom. 2016? Yeah. Yes. Uh, I mean... Sure? Like, we could take turns, but I'd like to play it. Because I'm, I'm in a, I mean, I've been in a really big Doom mood. Because right. the new DLC for Eternal came out. Ah, <clears throat> I see. And I've, yeah, sure. I haven't even beat Doom Eternal yet. So I've been sitting there playing Doom Eternal. I'm like... Do you have the be, first one? Yeah, I have all the Dooms. I love Doom. I like looking to the left. I feel like a fucking moron because I keep looking to the left and all I'm reading is, your stream is still running. We've just paused to preview to save your resources. Because I keep thinking you used to have your camera up there, so I'm like looking at a black screen. Do you want to see my face? Yes, please. <clears throat> I Let's remember I once did a job where I had a couple of kids relaying letters. I don't know. I want to do a random voice really quick. You know what, buddy? I'll give you it. <clears throat> I was feeling it, Mr. Krabs. Can you see me? Let me see. Oh, why is it so low? Because your mom. Yeah, probably right. My mom used her telepathic mind powers to lower it. God, you are really low. No, no, it, that that I'm not low. The camera was low. It was like that. Oh, uh, that's perfect. No. Why are you staring at my crotch? So... Before you were just it was just your head. I only want Amla doing that. Amla? Yeah. Like I Lama. forgot her name. Lama? Yeah. Lama's alpacas? Yeah. Morty <laughs> The Minotaur? Excuse me? Morty the Minotaur. Oh. With his assless Please heart stop chaps. making references to that. You I played it one time, you're like, no, I'm making all the references that nobody will know. It's so funny. That fucking Minotaur was hilarious. It was great. For security reasons, right? Actually, because that way I... I, I can't see that word, because I lose a lot less time. Uh... I don't... Uh, <laughs> um, <laughs> Are you okay? I can't see the word, Michael! Thank you! I don't have to deal with clients hitting on me or pestering me after the job's done. Can you stop? <laughs> Doing it for fun now. <laughs> stop looking at me. <laughs> I'll always look at you during. What? I said I'll always look at you during, Michael. <laughs> I was waiting for you to be like... It's a lie, I'm just lonely. <laughs> Sonic the Hedgehog. <laughs> Jay just grabbed his Sonic the Hedgehog on the Xbox and just whipped it and hit his piano. Sonic 06, baby. Uh, I'm so glad we're done shattered. with that. <laughs> Actually, no, I don't. I want to treasure that thing and pass it down as a family heirloom. I also don't have to lose time proving my worth because big boobs equals small brain or some shit like that. I mean, protecting my identity is one of the reasons, but the few times I've shown myself... Uh, they weren't even risky or dangerous jobs, just run-of-the-mill security checks. I don't know, maybe I need to show up as a disheveled nerd or something. Give them what they expect to see. I mean, you'd probably still be hot, babe. Well, let's be real. I just don't show up and save myself the I mean, it might even be more hot just because you're more relatable. Well, the questions. Just things I've been curious about and always forget to ask. So many... I, I, I hope it slamming into the piano got picked up <laughs> on my mic. Could you I heard it? it. Oh, great. Perfect. I just what was other, like, fuck. What other random games do I have? <laughs> 
I see a lot of Wii games, but I need I you have, to read your lines. I have a couple Wii games, but nothing like, that's a weird-ass Wii game. Um, I have a, I have a Nerf shooter. That's a weird-ass game. It's a little weird. I don't remember if it was good or not. So many Alice Rabbit headlines have made me wonder about the hacking business, too. Oh, I'll remember to ask you things next time, then. Well, I'll take my leave now. See ya! She's like, don't, don't go! I'm sorry, I'm just personifying Hello, myself. sugar. <gasps> Ow! Hello, Mr. Donovan. Like my pop used to say, never touch the ass of a woman with metallic arms. <clears throat> hmm. I think it's more like plastic and carbon fiber. They're hard as fuck, and that's all my abdomen felt. Do you normally greet people that way? I'm a man that contains himself. They can't yeah. contain himself when he sees something he likes, kid. Like Spider-Man! <laughs> I was like, where is he going with this? What is, he about to, what is he about to say? Oh, but don't worry, you're safe. You're flatter than field at my summer house. Like my wife. <laughs> and the shallow grave in, in, my, in the field that I buried her in. <laughs> Bit of advice, shouldn't provoke the one serving your drinks or food. Don't be offended, kid. You have your audience. I'm just not part of it. Today I'm making this quick one. Gotta tend to Life business in a while. Justice. Having said that, I'll just have the usual. Mr. Donovan wants the unit usual, huh? Three He's days such a and fucking he prick. A drink. I love him. I don't think I can like him. I like, mean, I like making jokes about Spider-Man. He's like, I do the things the way I do them, and I stick to that. Knows, knows what people want, and he gives it to them. I just don't like, I don't know. Spider-Man! Yeah, I don't like Spider-Man. Yeah, do you like my copy of the Holy Bible right next to a copy of Dracula? The most unholy <laughs> No, I story. can't see any titles of the books. Here, look! <laughs> well, I thought you were about to pull the entire fucking... The entire... <laughs> I should... I'm like, I'm like I, if, if something's about to fall, I'm going to minimize and throw it on camera as quickly as possible. That's fine. The it's, usual. I've had this bookcase for like half of my life but it's pretty sure this will work why did you read my line are you gonna answer me are you gonna, gonna answer for your crimes because we've been only going for 43 minutes sounds like someone's not gonna answer for his crimes i just what did you today mr donovan that girl i interviewed yesterday is coming again in a couple of weeks so i was working on a clinch and exclusive interview just succeed? Who the hell do you think you're talking to? I'm Donovan D. Dawson. Sorry, that's not my name. J. Jonah Jameson. I always get what I want. I always get Spider-Man. Sure, I had to blackmail the editors of the other outlets, but the end result is what matters. The Goblin! <laughs> <laughs> hey, goblins. I don't like them. <laughs> ah! I see. <clears throat> Wait, blackmail? You'd be surprised at the kind of stuff you find out and get the right people drunk. Hmm. Hey, a signature on the glass over there. Ah, uh, uh, yeah. That big titted Lillum was here? Came yesterday for the concert, yeah. Anything juicy come out of her visit? No. Gossip worthy? No. Tabloid worthy? No. Come on, there has to be something. No. Well, her love for what she does is so honest and pure that anyone who tries to ruin it should be ashamed. Oh, don't give me that shit. Throw me a bone here, anything. <laughs> I got nothing. Everyone has a price. How much for you to spill the beans about Spider-Man? I'm serious. <laughs> if you said nothing that would be used against her that you didn't already know. Fine. Say, are many of your interns women, Mr. Donovan? All of my interns are women's kid. Except for Women's? one. Spider-Man! No, this prick named Peter Parker! <laughs> Every like, single one of them. It's a pack of hungry, desperate bitches. Mm. 
I only win. Did you ever watch Race for Hope? The movie? Yeah. A movie about a journalist looking for clues regarding Spider-Man. The tacky movie had everything romance, action, a Spider-Man with sunglasses. It also sold me I'm on fucking ketamine right now. Okay. It also sold the weird <laughs> testicle image of what journalism is. Isn't that, like, a, de a depressant? Yes. I'm Isn't guessing that, lots of girls. Like heroin? Or am I thinking of something else? I think you might be thinking of something else. Oh I'm guessing God. lots of girls saw that in high school and wanted to become journalists. Sorry. Wait. I'm sorry. Jill, I got a question for you. Do you see this white powder I got right here in my hand? I need, you look, I need you to look left really quick. <laughs> oh, yeah, Spider Man! No! And now I have to deal with that shit. Did you know what Spider Man turned emo? How can you be so sure? Yeah, that was my. Uh... My first brother-in-law was a doctor. He said that a couple of years after that emergency heart movie, all of his interns were women for a long while. And this why... And this why you don't let... This why you don't oh, let... Yeah, ketamine is a sedative. <laughs> a heavy sedative. So Wait, he please. would not be like... Oh! And now help me out here. And this why you don't let brats. Am I reading that right? And this why you don't... And this, yeah, I assume it's a typo, but you. And this is why it. you don't. And this is why you don't let brats that barely understand that what responsibilities are pick up. Career. But career, huh? Do you perhaps know a girl named Kimberly Lavalette? Doesn't ring a bell. Who is she? Uh, nobody. Forget I said anything. I mean, it's just uh, any interesting preview of tomorrow's news. You expect me to share my information when you wouldn't share your scoop on the singer? I can one share when there's honestly nothing to share. Uh-huh. I'm going to be a good citizen today and let this one pass. Have you heard of a group called the Harbingers of Death? Yeah, I played Genshin Impact. Uh, La Senora is pretty hot. Not really, no. There's some fact, all the ones group wanting to overthrow the whiteness. Pretty hot. I read their manifesto in the bathroom once. Interesting piece and even better makeshift toilet paper. They talk about how the organization is corrupt, full of mob bosses or something like that, like the Kingpin. I mean, one of them just shoots a, shoots a whale at you. That's pretty cool. What are you talking about? To the Genshin Impact. <laughs> cool. That's it. <laughs> I think I've heard about that summer. What of them? They sent a message to some outlets saying they have proof of their claims. They're going to release it to the public tomorrow. Oh. That'd be interesting to see, I think. I know, right? All right, kid. Give me a bleeding Jane so I can call it a day. Mary Jane? Spider-Man? Spider-Man! <laughs> say the name of this drink three times in front of a mirror and you'll look like a, a fucking cuck. Bleed Jane. Here. Simple enough for you, see? Huh. So I've heard this is Dana Zane's bar, is it true? Yeah. Never thought I'd heard about the undefeated of the West again. More so after that incident with the bears, where is she? It's running out of some bears? Six years ago, a cash strapped Dana Zane entered an underground ring for money. Frakes ten enraged grizzly bears, she beat them all without killing them. I heard she set them free afterwards, too. And you were there? I was drunk and bored, what can I say? Do you know if she lost her arm there? Can't remember, too drunk. Maybe she's had her prosthetic then, too. I heard someone there suggest that she's lost it after throwing a baseball out of a stadium, some stadium. Through so hard, her, so hard, her arm fell off. I'm drunk, sorry. <laughs> I'm, I'm on ketamine. <laughs> uh, but that sounds more like an upstantiated rumor. More like something she made up, am I right? Well, I gotta go. Next time you see Dana, tell her for, for winning me my second yacht. Thank her. I Not tell cannot her. read. My eyes are blonking out right now. I, I, I knew betting on her was the right choice. Saying. Please come again. Yeah, yeah. It's break time. So we'll end this episode of break time. Or will we? Yes. What so if bye, this everyone. So just never end. <clears throat>
you'd never know because it would never release. <laughs> That's true. Goodbye, everyone. It everybody. never ends. We can't, we can't upload it. Don't forget to subscribe. It helps us well, out a lot. If you don't want to subscribe, you don't have to. Just like you don't, if someone offers you a drink, you don't have to drink it. That's true. Be safe, and, but don't be a dweeb. If it's like your first drink of the night and it's someone you know, you should totally take that shit. But if it's like someone you totally don't know and they're like, <laughs> drink this, then you should totally take that shit. What hey, drugs are you on? I, uh, ketamine. Okay. Don't listen to James. Bye, everyone. I'm just kidding. Don't take it. That's, been, that's dangerous. <laughs>